Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. In today's episode, we have an exquisite two-bedroom gem and a three-bedroom masterpiece, which I happen to be in right now. My name is Peter Ngigi. Welcome to Property Focus. Brilliant. Now, first stop comes to this two-bedroom unit right over here. So. It's rather bare, rather exposed in its very honest form, but this is what this unit looks like. This is the balcony area overlooking this other building. You've got tall ceilings right over here, open plan kitchen on this section. You've got a pantry area right over here. Work with me, work with me with the vision on this. Here's your hallway area. You've got two rooms. You've got one on this side, one on this side. Let's start with this one. Still in its very raw form, ladies and gentlemen, you've got this two bedroom unit, window right on this section, provision for your wardrobes over here. And then on my right, we've got your common cloakroom in this section. You've got your shower right over here. And inside this section is your master bedroom. Still being constructed. This is a stylish two bedroom, wardrobes on that side, balcony on this side. It's gonna be a spectacular unit. Now, many of you are asking, how much is this unit going to cost? Well, this will cost you 7.5 million rather, and you might as well book it in right now. This is in Kitusuru, but enough of this stylish two bedroom unit in its exposed honest form. Let's go to the three bedroom unit and see what magnificence awaits us here at Kitusuru Falls. Let's go. And welcome to this three bedroom architectural masterpiece. Right off the bat, like the handle, like the door, it's in white. Usually they have brown mahogany, but I like the way they've made it uh, just nice and elegant. So come along to this section. Here is the kitchen area. You design shape right over here. You've got your granite that is of note. Right over here, you've got an elevated kitchen countertop. Right on top of it, you've got these pendant lighting, which is in black. Cabinetry at the top, extractor right over here, cook station right there. On the other side, you've got your oven, you've got your microwave, and your provision for your fridge. And I like that they've given this space, you could even get even a bigger fridge, which is superb. Another area right over here to put in your spaghetti, pasta, salt, tea, coffee, all of that. So come along into the pantry. Pantry area is also sizable. I admire the way Kitisuru Falls have just done their floor to ceiling heights. Looks like about 3.0, 3.2, which is really good. Washing machine can be stationed over there with every provision for it. So come along into the living room. Very spacious for those unforgettable hangout moments. You've got your chandelier over here, lots of light coming in over here. So you don't even need to put on those lights. Windows on my left sliding doors on my right again almost floor to ceiling right at the top you've got the curtain rods which are in black as well so i like the theme that they have going on over here you've got the black sockets black chandeliers black curtain rods very nice and of course the floor is a bit muted beautiful right over here you've got a vanity area you've got your granite again for the vanity area cylindrical sort of basin with the black faucet oval mirror provision for wall sconce as well but come along into this side you've got your powder room or cloak room showers over here as well provisioned in black awning window right on this section tiles are very beautiful super beautiful You've got white tiles for the gray veins, vanity on this section, faucets are in black. I really like this white and black theme they've got going on over here. It's very modern. So welcome to bedroom number one. Into bedroom number one here at Kitusuru Falls. This unit, by the way, just in case you're wondering, how much is this unit? 10 million bob and this can be yours first bedroom has its balcony right over here so that the sunlight can just get into the room and gently wake you up and tell you my good friend it is time to start the day and you don't even feel bad about it because this unit is absolutely amazing wardrobes are just super sleek i mean this is just 
fine living. Might I add the location for this unit is Kitusuru, new Kitusuru. So might as call that number, find out where, and you could come see this unit yourself. Again, you've got the light fixtures, which are black. Room number two. Here's the second room, could be an office, a room for the little one, a haven for the little one. It's really up to you and what you choose to do with this particular room. So you've got your windows on this section. This room is a bit smaller, but you could convert it into anything you so wish. Wardrobes, which are quite tall, which is a very good touch, the high ceilings and onto the master bedroom where the magic happens. Come on. place that's an oasis for tranquility and just rejuvenation. This is the ultimate three bedroom unit right over here at 10 million. Again, you've got your balcony on this section, lots of wardrobe space right from here all the way till over here. It is just super good and you could still stack in more stuff at the top over there. This is a six by six bed. It is just calm and beautiful. So opens from this side and it's just views and views of new Kitusuru. Absolutely amazing. Now it's in suit as well. You've got your water closet on this side. You've got your awning window, towel rack, which is in black. Same tiles have been maintained. And you've got your fixtures and shower heads, which are also in black, which just looks mwah, superb, superb. Come along, ladies and gentlemen. This has been the tour of the three bedroom unit and choose which one you like. Either the two bedroom or the three bedroom, it's really up to you. This particular three bedroom is going for an enviable 10 million shillings and the two bedroom is going for 7.5 million shillings. Write in the comments which unit you would take or if you want to purchase a unit, call that number. Now, we're gonna find out how you can own this unit at about, let's say 80,000 a month. Let's find out from the segment heads with the financiers of this property. Stay tuned. Here's the thing about us. We're all more than just one thing. Like Grace here, all her students call her Teacher Grace. When she is not at work, she is not afraid to try new things. Yenyewe, maisha ni kujaribu tu. Na ikifika weekendi, anaitwa Gracey Teke Teke because she is quick on her feet and a trendsetter. Lakini pale home, she is Mama Toto or just Mami. Naisi Toshe, yeye ni CS wa home affairs. That's why we offer every kind of financial solution for every kind of you. Briefly introduce yourself. Thank you very much. Uh, my name is Geoffrey Moura. I'm the head of credit at uh, Kenya Mortgage Finance Company. Uh, this is a company that was established in 2018 and uh, a public-private uh, partnership between the government of Kenya and uh, the financial institutions in the country. Primarily to come and address an issue that uh, was uh, uh, seen in the market, uh, the uh, inaccessibility of uh, mortgage funding in the market. Therefore, the institution was formed to alleviate the issue of liquidity. There was a big mismatch uh, between uh, uh, the long-term funding and the assets that were available in the market to facilitate uh, mortgages. And therefore, through a study that was done in 2017 by World Bank uh, to uh, establish what are the barriers to mortgage entry in the country. And therefore, funding was one of the uh, barriers that was identified, and especially lack of affordable uh, finance in the market. Therefore, the government saw it uh, good to form the institution, invited the private uh, uh, partners, that is the financial institutions in the market, the banks and circles, 
to come and partner with the government to form KMRC. That's how KMRC came about. Okay, good. So how are you able to come up with these rates? Uh, Kenya Mortgage Finance Company is uh, funded uh, through uh, a sovereign debt uh, through the government. We have two credit lines, uh, essentially from African Development Bank and World Bank. These are concessional loans that have been given uh, through the government of Kenya. So uh, KMRC is able to access this funding at concessional rates, uh, rates at below 5%. And that is the funding we use to finance uh, the banks and circles that are able then to lend to Kenyans. We are working with 20 financial institutions, uh, 11 circles and uh, nine banks. And therefore Kenyans can be able to access affordable mortgages or loans to buy or build their units from these 20 institutions. And APSA is one of them. We have two products currently uh, funded under the two credit lines, African Development Bank and World Bank. Uh, and they have limits and they have a requirement. Uh, under AFDB, we have a limit of uh, 8 million. You can access 8 million without any income requirement. Under World Bank, you can still access 8 million yes. with a maximum income of 200,000 per household. Uh, the value of the house also needs to be reasonable uh, within the affordable housing space. And we are looking at a range of 15 million. A property needs to be within 15 million. And these are loans you can access from these uh, institutions, ABSA being one of them. So Kenyans are invited to participate in this because today with the increase of the rates, you can actually get a fixed rate mortgage for a long term. And the rate will not change for the 20 years or for 25 years, depending on what you agree with your financial institution. These properties uh, can be sourced either from private uh, developers or from the government uh, supported uh, development. Yes. So it's open. You can either, you have a plot, you can go and build on the plot, or you can buy from the ready units in the market, both from private or government uh, developments. Tell us your parting shots. Mortgage finance is the most efficient way of owning a property because you get very many advantages. One, there is what we call mortgage relief on the interest that you pay on your loan. KRA allows you to deduct 25% of your income every month if you are servicing a mortgage. And therefore, that is income that is coming back to you. So for instance, if you are paying the 65,000 on your mortgage, you're already talking about 25,000 off every month. Yeah, that is income that is back to your pocket. Secondly, there are many other advantages. You have insurance that covers your property and covers your life also. That in case of any uh, death or any other disability, your mortgage will be funded fully by the insurance cover. And therefore, so we encourage Kenyans to take advantage of this. Single digit uh, mortgages that are in this market, this has never happened before. Take advantage because this is the way to go for everyone. My name is Stella Karoki, um, Product Manager, um, Mortgages and Secured Loans from Absa Bank. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Tell us about these interest rates and what is good about Absa. This time we are focusing on affordable housing. Um, so the interest rate is at 9.5 and for companies with an MOU with us, so the repayment is checked from source, it's at 9%. This is a rate that is fixed. You can actually stretch your repayment to 25 years. It's both for affordable, I mean for purchase and construction. Mm -hmm. um, so it's the best rate currently in the market. Okay, mm -hmm. so we're here at Kitusuru Falls. Mm -hmm. Is there any down payment required for these units? For the houses that are 8 million and below, we are doing 100% financing. Um, of course, uh, you will have insurance that you pay in addition because of being doing 100% financing. For the houses that are 10 million and above, you will pay a 10%. Um, so we finance you 90%. So for those ones, then you require a 10% down payment. Mm -hmm. Any additional fees? Yes, a mortgage comes with additional fees, but remember those are external fees. So you will have 
um, to do valuation of the property, the lawyer's fees because of their full registration process. Then of course you need to pay the stamp duty. All those additional costs that come with getting a mortgage. However, from an APSA perspective, all we will require from you is to pay an interest rate of 9.5 and a negotiation fee. Looking at the current uh, properties we are at, at Kisusuru, the two bedroom is going for 7.5. Um, if you decided to take that as a rental income, your rent will be 60,000. However, if you just added five, which would be 65,000, you will own it, you will pay that as a repayment, and consequently you will own that house within 25 years or less. So I encourage everybody, whether you're salaried or whether you are, um, you're doing your business or whether you have any other source of income, take advantage of this affordable housing from KMRC and own a home and it will be the best asset that you'll have for your family. Welcome Simon. Okay. Briefly introduce yourself. Uh, my name is Simon Kimani, uh, Product uh, Director, Pro Product Development Director at Kings Fox uh, Limited. The idea behind uh, Kituzulu residents is to cater, to give a solution to, to give affordable housing, mostly to the young Kenyans. Most of our clients, most of our target uh, customers are aged between 22 years or they to allow 45 years. And uh, we have both local customers and uh, diaspora market. 30% of our buyers are actually diaspora based all over the, the world. So we have, it's mixed development with house, with shops, we have school, a preschool, a health center, we have gym, we have swimming pool. We have enough parking for all the, all the homeowners. Tell us about the quality in the units. Having been in this industry for a long time, more for 15 plus years, we specialize on giving quality housing to, to quality finishes, quality structures. We have a couple, we, we, pack, we partner with, uh, with, um, with the, all the professionals, consultants, starting with very good consultants, architects, structural engineers, mechanical and uh, electrical engineers. So for all our units, we are offering fitted kitchens with uh, with a microwave, with a oven, with a cooker unit, and then uh, a hood. So quality is guaranteed for our units. Quality is our is is key. It's key to all our developments. Any advice to the market uh, for first-time home buyers? It's usually good maybe to buy into the project maybe early. Do you uh, do you uh, uh, background checks to all the developers? Is this developer doing so many projects concurrently? Is this uh, does he have track record of finishing projects in good time? It's always good to be cautious. Is this developer well financed or well backed up by a financial institution to back him up, or he want to use maybe the the buyers? money to to develop so when you are sure this developer is have a track record of completing their project in time it's well backed up by a good financial institution like absa he should uh, you should be sure the project will complete in good time do you tell us about yourself thanks so much peter mm -hmm. so my name is grace elsie I work for Kings Fox Limited. I'm the operations manager. And thank you so much for having me. I'm glad to have you. Now, these units look amazing. Thank you so much. So we're in the three bedroom unit right now. Correct. Now, how much, what, what, terms of payments? Tell us about that. So currently mm -hmm. we are selling our two and three bedroom apartment. Mm -hmm. Our two bedroom is going for 7.5 million. Okay. And our three bedroom is going for 10 million currently. 
So to purchase a unit with us, we only ask for 20% as a down payment. And then the 80% is stretched out till December 2024. So of course we work with either quarterly installments or monthly installments. We are very flexible. So it's uh, up to the client to have a good discussion with us. Mm -hmm. And then we, we settle whether we are doing the monthly or the quarterly payments. Mm -hmm. Of course, we also take on mortgages. Specifically, today we are uh, ABSA. So, if you're taking a mortgage, I know ABSA is, uh, is giving up to 100%. That is for the two bedroom, for example. Okay. And the three bedrooms are giving up to 8, eight million. Mm -hmm. So, you just put a down payment of 20%, and then they will clear the remaining uh, 80 for you. Okay, yes. interesting. This yes. is very interesting. Thank you. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it has been a phenomenal one. Unfortunately, all good things have to come to an end. That was pretty insightful. Remember, dream big, keep watching Property Focus. Stay tuned. I've been your host, Peter Ngiti.